Okay, let's 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 let's. I don't know. Every hello, hello, hello. Okay, now let's start over again. Um, Montreal Expos used to be in Montreal, and then they were gone. Now they're supposed to come back in Little League. It didn't matter how they were coming back, whether they get in or they don't get in. Once the thought pattern is there, it's in the machine, everybody knows. I'm in the machine, you're in the machine. If you can't get in to do it, but I do, because we're two different people. We all get in for two different reasons, and I'm in there to do two different things. So everything's a little upside down right now. Because... I want to know about Chivas Regal. Who makes Chivas Regal? How many years? What year came on that bottle? I told you I can't do this all alone. This is for all of us. If you think there's nothing out there, then you're fooling yourself. If you think I'm a fool, that's fine. But I'm a fool who did a lot of studying in the last year. Okay? And now it's starting to click. With that new system out there, AR, right? That new system there, I think we all have it in us. That's why this change is coming. I think we're all going to be able to do what I do. It's just that I'm doing it first. Just like that. We've all been injected with it in our lifetime. It's never been around before. Okay? It was injected, I don't know, back in the 60s and 50s. It's a mark on your arm. It's a mark of 666 on all of us. Except none of us can break through it before. And I feel I've uh, not broken through it. I think I have met it at the gate. And I became its friend. I became its friend because I'm no one's enemy. I don't mean any harm to anybody for anything I'm doing. This is a book and it's a chapter in the book. I have been working on this book. No one wanted to help me with this book. I asked and I asked and I found out I had to do it all myself, all the time, everything. Whatever I did, it was always I had to do it and it was me and me and, and it didn't matter if I did it and I didn't do it, if I didn't show up and do it. But what if I did show up and do it? Then they give me shit for it. So you know what? Sometimes I wanted to go and sometimes I didn't. So I started to sort of separate from life and not really care as much as everybody else of stupid little things. So they thought I was a little clowny, but that's okay. Because I like the clowns. I like that red nose. Rudolph, the red nose reindeer. So I'm saying, okay, now we have this gambling industry that goes all the way from Canada all the way into Australia. And I'm not going to tell you what the name is, okay? But I, what I will tell you is it's a beta creation, e-world, um, gaming, anything electronic. It's into anything electronic, anything electronics, a little, and things you can control, certain things that you control. Like they're not going to have a pinball machine because they can't control the ball. Unless they tilt the whole floor, everybody's going to feel it, right? So they're feeling it. There's like these feelers. And down in Toronto, there's all these Germans Mennonites that I worked with for many years. I take off my hat to you guys. Okay, while well, I talk about this because I was with you, so I'm taking off my hat in honor because I know what you did. And I figured out if the ant went, ants went marching by in the lifetime of anyone's lifetime, well, these people came up here the time that they did. I do not know, know or right now need to know what time that was. All I know is they took land up. And by taking that land up, eventually, they can get pushed out of that land. And the one who brought them here and helped them out for their services gave them the land. And one day they're going to take it back. And no one's going to be able to be there. And everybody's going to be pushed and pushed and pushed. I don't get it. What is it between owning land? I don't get it. I don't get it. Because at a certain point, you can't take care of it. You need others to take care of it. And you have to pay somebody extra. What is the goal about winning money? What is the goal? I gambled for 30 years. It's a high. We need the challenge on our earth and we need a gamble. Take a chance. And when there's no more chances seems to be in the world, well then the ones with no money, oh that pitchfork, that's, that's actually two fours next to each other. Because if I open them up, they turn into a swastika, but nobody can see the way I did it. I turn it upside down. Things are upside down in this world, they're inside out. So I'm going down figuring all this space of the Mennonites and Elmira. Now you've got to figure out what it means, Elmira. And understand that word. Look at its flag. Once I know somebody's interested in it, I'll look it up. I'm not going to spend my time looking up for everybody that I haven't spoken to yet. I can't possibly do that. In fact, I'm not looking up... I'm not looking up half of what I should be looking up. But I did look up some stuff. And uh, you know what? It comes back to the same thing. Jesus Christ. Somehow it's set up by Jesus Christ. Because Christopher Columbus stands on guard. Who does he stand on guard for, Christopher Columbus? Because it's all behind Christopher. I don't care who else is involved right now. 
Okay, whatever I mentioned, who's involved, the shipping yards, the, 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 the bombing of the Titanic, where they, they traveled for five days, but there seemed to be a ship right next door. Back then, that ship, that ship that passed by was next door, that ship there, that ship wasn't ready to sail anywhere, unless they were planning war of something. And never mind, some of the ferrymen got off the boat. Christenberg said the ferrymen, 10,000 souls are on the line. Well, that's a number meaning one, two, three creation. 10,000 souls, one, two, three creation. There were 123 people that got off the boat of the Newfoundlander, right? They're one of them that got stuck in 1912, which is 100 years ago also, okay? And all these icebergs are breaking off. The Newfoundlander, they went out, they sent them to get seals. But don't you know what a seal is? It's a seal signed and delivered. It's a letter. They sent to get him a letter. Now they brought up seals. They mixed up everything. They mixed the animals up with our language. They mixed everything up. We're not supposed to know. The English language is, is, is powerful. When you can go in and dig and just bounce around, somehow they had to knock out those 123, which they knocked out because of the, the Titanic. They were setting the Titanic up at the time. They started building in 1909. Did they both go down in the same year to Titanic? And the other one, I didn't, I didn't check what that was. I don't remember the name. You're going to have to look back in my cassette. Um, I'm looking at you this way because you usually see when I'm bald, right? So now if you're looking on top of my head, you have to look under my head. And now you're looking under while well, I'm looking straight ahead. I'm just looking into the mirror, guys. What's going up must come down. Well, I want to see a Christmas Charlie Brown because the Charlie Brown has just come into the house. Okay, guys, I know I can do it. I know I can do it. I really believe in myself wholeheartedly. And then again, I try my best. I only believe I could because I try my best and that's as good as I can give. Is that good? Well, you have to judge the rest of it. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Charlie Brown did his best. He was fumbling balloony, but he did his best and he thought he was just bad luck or something. He just kept falling down all over the place. So, so now you have Edward Bronfman bringing back the Expos. Now that's so fishy because I think he's on the Hebrew side and that it's just so perfect that it was made for the Hebrews and there's a Hebrew who won the world, all the money of the world, and then there's going to be a Hebrew who's going to just dissolve everything in the world. It's going to be two Hebrews at the end. Can that be possible or is it the Germans? I mean because I keep finding a reason for everybody. I have some reasons for a lot of people. but. Um, I know he's somehow connected into the horses and this world is a trot and pace because all the colors that I use, right, are all coming out of the horse races and Liverpool, the game of pool. Those are the two, horse races and Liverpool. So is it the English, the French? Is it, the, is it really Liverpool? Did John Lennon get knocked out by his own place? He wasn't in first place, he was on top. They didn't call him one because if they would have won one, they would have got one. And one got one and one was fine. And one was fine with all, and one with all is a lot, because it's everybody. Everybody counts. So um, I'm stepping on my mouse. Tell me what you think this is. Hold on. Can you see it? It's a garbage can, right? It's the F, it's the D, it's the A, it's the R, it's the McDonald arch holding it. McDonald's arch, okay, once you design it properly, it comes into a big, big, big tiger, okay, because you don't see the inside of it, okay, don't you see, don't you see, what are we going to talk about now, um, the poor people, no, the buckle on a pants, if you'll ever look in it, it's actually a square, it's for putting, there was something they used to put in that, and then they ended up using it for something else, um, then they had this one, Gomer's Pile, Gomer's Pile, Jim Neighbors, J-N-N, -N. Gilligan's Isle, Gomer's Pile, Gilligan's Isle, Jim Neighbors, okay, gobble, 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 do you know why the gobble chickens are like that and the turkeys have all those pucks on their marks, because, um, because when your, your mind is sour in thinking and you correct it, and you're always correcting it, it creates those burning acid marks, uh, the same way you see on the turkeys. And uh, it must be because um, what happens when they lie to everybody all the time. 
or what happens when you think all the time that's what happens to your brain I'm not quite sure yet I didn't get into that I'm not sure where to go with this all I know is I didn't go very far right now King King Edward King Beta, listen to this, Edward Bronfman, but listen to his last name, okay? Listen to what his last name says. It says, Bron, bronze, okay? Man, a bronze man. He got a bronze medal for coming in third. So who came in second? So that means there's somebody ahead of him. Bronze man means he's third, right? Then it says in the middle of its name, it says, Beta Bronfran. It says, Ron F., Ron F. Mann, because that's my middle name is, is Mann. So that's Ron F. Mann. Now there has to be one more. If there's the on, there has to be the off. Offerman? Offerman? Is there an Offerman in the house? What does that mean? What I'm trying to get to is I'm reading through the names to see because that name seems to, to carry some energy. And it might not be the Expos, but because the Expos are coming back, I would think of the name. So maybe he's not included in this because it's a Shivvis Regal. It's Regal, and it's a king, and that's his color, and it's all perfect in his name. So at first I was scared of him, and now I'm not sure anymore. I think I can accept him as he is now. Uh, the other thing is that Bronfman has a count of 28, and the 28 is no longer a 28. So now if you ever see 68... You can't see 68. Whoever has 68 right now has got a huge number. That's my number. 68. 7286. 68. Because I'm ahead of the heavens now. Before I was behind the heavens. Now I'm one step ahead. R S T E A R S T. East, east, east. The beast, the beasts in the east, the beasts in the east. So now we go down to Toronto and we try to figure out now they have all this land and Elmira. Who owns Toronto? Niagara Falls is out there, so you got everything. He's got all the spirits to go down there. He's probably into one of his chemistry, chemistry things and stuff. Uh, we have Liverpool in England. French have been fighting with the Quebecois. You know, they say, je me souviens. La belle Provence, je me souviens. So je me souviens almost means to me, you know what, there was something here before. Because it was put on just like that, and it's, it's just a crazy thing. Maybe the, it's not the English or the French, you know? I think that was the land of liberty, the home of the brave. Somehow, okay, when Hitler was in war, he started that war with a Jew. I'm almost guaranteed he started that war with a Jew. So what actually happened? What actually happened during all that? Where, where was the change? Maybe there was no change. Maybe that Jewish person is running it right now and he's all the way up in Canada where the Mennonites are. Right? Because he set up the whole thing, save that land for me, I'll treat you right. Don't worry, guys. The ants are in the field. The ants come marching one by round, hurrah, hurrah. The other thing I had here was, um, let me see what this is. Ah, uh, the name in the game. Let's do this together. The name in the game, because you've got to play all the sports games, right? in order to decode whoever's decoding something. So you've got to do all the sports games, all the sports teams, all the sports cities. You have to do the routes on the highways, but don't worry about it. You cut it down really short and you start really small and it grows all by itself. It grows all by itself. So we'll say hockey. H-O-K-E-Y, 8-15-3-11, oh my God, 3, oh my God, 25 or 27, oh my God. Oh my God! Hockey gets two Y's at the end, because remember when we said the I birth. So when the, when the Y comes at the end and it's expressive, it's got to be expressive for two. Although there's two there, we'd have to have another two, and it would automatically total up fifty-two. Okay, they threw the prize of the Stanley Cup on the ice to start the puck, the puck, Peter Puck. P-U-C-K, puck, fuck, shit, crap. You know, it's all the same thing, right? Don't you remember we shouldn't say it? We say it, we don't say it. Watch out when we say it, when you say those words. This has all been a game, my friends, for a long, long, long time, the way I see it. We're still in chapter three, and the truth starts to break off like the Antarctica. Someone blew it up from underneath 
the ground and they let it go to change the whole world. It's going to get old because when the split comes, the matrix can can breathe. They're they're in danger. You can let it happen. I time time is is running. A uh, a uh, time we must love the cold. Come, come, love, come, love, come together. The time runs out. Unless we notify ourselves to believe of the words that I have just noticed, I have spoken from beneath my breath unto you in a system that goes out and beyond, beyond the surface of the land and beneath the surface of the oceans. We extend into the hearts of all of thy creator. They tell us we are in trouble and they can't change the game. Everybody's going home anyways. It's just there's another 5,000 years of play and you have a chance to come here again a few times, depending where your marks are. You don't have to believe chapter 23. The acting, the actor, the flipper, the try of the flipper on the pinball machine, if you hit her, it's an alligator. Okay, Allegheny, I say goodbye to the airline, Allegheny, are you involved to come to me? Time is the essence as I taste it and my words speak the color from which I see the deepest of all deeps. We must never give up because the good always wins no matter what. And we will win. We will stand up and we will win by understanding that the words I speak are not spoken for zero reason. Because it is us at zero that is all the reason. Because at zero on the Fahrenheit, okay, it is zero is 32, which means the recreation, creation of one, of one man, of one who won, who won, who will win. He will win the one prize, the prize of the cup, of the cup of who cares what Stanley says. Because I don't care what Stanley says, as long as it's a cup that I can drink from and share and share and fill up that cup and fill it up and fill up. Philip, what is Philip doing with this? What is this about Philip tonight? Is there a Prince Philip around? Is something going on with Prince Philip? Is there a Prince Philip around? Prince, <clears throat> Prince Saudi Arabia, princes, Aladdin, Aladdin, the prince, the prince. Where's the prince? Are the prince on his hands? Is it a handprint? Did somebody make a handprint? Did somebody lose his hand? What, what, what? Is it snowing somewhere? What, what got printed? <clears throat> is it printed? Is it, is it up? Is it up? What does it say? What does it say? Independence Day is coming. Independence Day is coming because one man will call the road and he will make it very cold. He will split the Arctic ice and he won't make it very nice. He thinks of you, he thinks of us, but he never really thinks of anything twice because he's not nice, he's not nice. He's going to break the Arctic ice. It's time to go and time to know and time to say it's gone. But please, my friends, and understand it's only just my song. It's a book, it's a title, it's a role that I'm playing, it's a role in the model I am. But every time you look at me, they always call me Sam. And I am the spirit angel of M. Sam is a spirit angel of M, and M in French means to love. I am the R spirit of M, and I come here to bring back all the love through chapter 24. We begin now now so we begin but i've never stopped so now it's really not an ending just a continuation so now we put the letter y or we leave it open depending where the end comes we have to put the y because the end of the y it says n and y nine a nine 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 the y is 25 and the n is 14 is 39 it's a total of three kings 13 13 13 or 39 or if you want to go the other way 71 which is the one passage to all the worlds and once you get the middle passage, the seventh one, well, you're already in the six other worlds. And now you've got 13 all together. And yourself makes the 14th and the 15th. Excuse me. I made a little mistake, and I have to back up, but I'm not. 
Okay, uh, let's see what else I have in here. Uh, reveal, pool. Oh my God. Oh, that's what it is. You know what it's saying here in this one? It's saying Liverpool to reveal truth. One man down. John Lennon down. Reveal truth. Ocean pool. Drowning. Independence. 22, 23. Two, two, 2,223 got killed on the boat, okay? Just let's take the 222, okay? Because one of them didn't get killed. Don't you remember? They accounted for everybody but Rose because she didn't give a real name. The other guy also gave the name, right? Do you remember one guy gave a name, one guy didn't? Who's missing, he said? Who's missing? So there's a name missing. What actually it says here is four twos. If you multiply that by the four actual lines of directions, east, west, north, and south, northeast, northwest, and all that, it's okay, there's four lines. Let's say you take a line one to nine, three to seven, two to eight, and four to six. That's all tens, right? But it's four, 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 four. Four times makes 1776. It proves that my theory is right. My theory is right, and because Rose didn't throw that diamond over until the end, that's what made it so perfect. It didn't make any sense. Do you understand what I'm saying? She knew. Rose knew what happened. That's why she threw the diamond overboard, because she knew, and she could never tell a secret, and she had enough living in this life with the secret she said. Do you remember she said when they had the thing about her, when they talked to her, and she died last year, and it's so perfect for everything to come now. She couldn't keep that secret anymore, Rose. And she threw the diamond over because she knew that she would never get the love that she had when she was there. We're gonna end this chapter at one marking point two in chapter 24. I am Raphael, Razami, Razaro. Let's go. We're on the road for a rock and roll. Just listen to the show. We'll take it on down, but we all got to get together because I'm not doing this alone, Charlie Brown. Don't leave me to be Charlie Brown all alone now. I can't do it without you. I can't do it with anybody. It's no use, but I won't give up. But if I never give up, all my friends are going to tell me I'm crazy because no one's listening to what I have to say. But I still won't give up because I'm listening and this is going to be my history to pass on to my son. One day when I go and I'm gone and I'll leave this to him, a couple of cassettes and a couple of bills underneath them. Phony bills, of course. I just cut off a couple of bills from the ducks or something with a couple of ducks feet and a rabbit foot. And I'll tell him to guess what? Take a hike and go get lucky yourself. You got to work for what you got. But sometimes you have to help the people and now it's very hard. Sometimes there are no jobs. There's things that have changed. Evolution, my friend. Evolution.